Do you ever wish that playing on HF was as easy as using a handy talkie? So we made this, we've been calling it the contraption. So basically this is a QMX, the QRP radio, with the Just OK Mini. This is the ridiculously small 20 meter antenna installed on top of it. And then on the side, we have a plate to be able to use a magnetic key for CW. Also tucked inside is a USB PD battery to be able to have it all in one little 3D printed package. To be able to play on 20 meters, all we have to do is extend the whip, untangle the counterpoise, throw it to the side. It's actually really, really forgiving. And then plug everything in. So unfortunately, all the plugs for the QMX are on the bottom and then plug in your headphones and then you're ready to go. But how well did it work? We were actually really shocked and surprised. It worked really well. We made a bunch of POTA contacts, good signal reports. We were able to pace back and forth in the backyard, hold it. It's really weird how freeing it is to be able to, wa to walk around and stuff. We love being able to be outdoors and do outdoor stuff. So we're looking forward to playing with us more outdoors while we're camping, maybe even hiking, stuff like that. Maybe we'll do a hiking POTA. You probably want to know what it sounds like and see it in action. So we actually took an earlier version of this to the local mountain where we're at to give it a shot. And we used that to figure out some quirks with it that we needed to fix. But please join us as we make a couple of contacts and you can hear it in operation for yourself. We recently designed a little bitty, ridiculously small pocket-sized antenna for 20 meters on ham radio. But we thought, what if we could put it on top of our inexpensive little QMX radio and use it like a handheld. You have to contend with a battery and how would you mount the antenna because it doesn't just connect straight directly to the radio with the BNC. So we had to design something. Hey, this would probably be a good spot to set up. Plenty of open area and beautiful mountain views. Don't fall off. I'm not falling off. Whoa, watch out Rose. But you can just see for miles and miles today. These trees weren't in the way. Michigan. Yep. W E Mike Werner. <laughs> low, low power, power low, low power. power. Thanks, Warner. <laughs> oh, very cool. Yay. So this weekend is Wes, the uh, weekend sprintathon for SKCC. And so I just switched it to straight key mode so that I can try <laughs> to get him. This is uh, this is Bert from I think he said Michigan. But this is super fun. <laughs> <laughs> And of course, we can't just try poda hunting. We've got to do a Wes. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go get your straight keying here in a second. You turn around. Which way? To your, just turn around so I can see your key. Five nine nine. Louisiana. Louisiana. <laughs> Fine business. Bart. QSL. Mike. So now you'll understand after you watch this why my keying was so bad. It's actually good. That was fun. Yay. That is so cool. What is it? W5ZR. 
Yeah. Definitely 599. Yep, 599. From the spirit of outdoor amateur Bert. radio. I actually like straight key mode better because I can do it left handed. Becky? Becky. Thanks. Eight, eight. 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 <laughs> Hugs and kisses. <laughs> Very cool. Those are some strong signals. <laughs> Whoa. Five, five, five six. Texas. Texas. <laughs> so Terry, if you watch this, you'll understand. <laughs> this is K5G Terry in Texas. It's a special event call sign, but the Pota app says it's Terry. Thanks, Terry. We don't know what the next step is for it, but we're just going to keep playing with it. I'd love to hear what you think in the comments. Um, and thanks for checking it out. And thanks for watching. If you made it this far and you haven't subscribed, but you want to see updates as things go along with this or other projects that we're doing, uh, please subscribe. It's also a great way to be able to support us that doesn't cost anything at all. Thanks for watching. 72.